like Trent and I have had a few chats. Yeah. And like feel something with Trent that I don't feel he. What is it like about him that really gets y'all? I just want to know. It's just a gut thing. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. Yeah. She wants Trent. She wants Trent. It's just different. Is a lot. I think, like, personally, right now, I need, like, a mad break. It's the part of, like, putting energy into something and just having it, like, come to nothing. I don't actually have that much energy to put in anywhere else right now. Definitely back to square one. I just want to let you know that I appreciate you... Yeah. ..being up front with Nate as well, and obviously... Making a decision, I know it hasn't been easy for you and obviously hasn't been easy for me, but yeah, I, know, I respect it. Really and hard. I knew that there was something there worth hanging around for and persisting. Yeah. So, because I just knew that we had something, and I guarantee there's no one that could turn my head. So, this is it now? 100%. I wanna, I wanna there's no work one. On this. Yeah, same. Yeah. And I hope you're the same. I am. Um, I feel like, yeah, Love Island's just starting now. <laughs> yeah, same. And we've got so much to look forward to. I'm actually excited. So am I. I'm so happy. I can't stop smiling. <laughs> I'm stoked. Coming on Love Island, I just had it in my head that I was going to find someone and hopefully fall in love. And I think Georgia's a perfect girl for me. Fucking finally. Put me through the rear. It was hard. Yeah. It was so hard. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. No, I Good thing has come I to see those both who wait, sides. though, right? 100%. It makes it even better when you get it. I feel the spark with Trent, and I'm so excited to see where this goes. Like, I feel it, and I know he feels it as well. <laughs> when he looks at me back with his big green eyes, I'm like, I melt. Are we sleeping on the day bed tonight? I think so. I think so. Do you want it? Yeah. I think so. <laughs> I'm very excited to sleep next to Trent. I'm excited to wake up to his cute little face. I can't believe we're out here. This is crazy. This is good. I just want to cuddle it. I've been waiting for like five days. I knew that if I really wanted it, I had to work for it and everything's paid off, so I couldn't be happier. It's the kind of love that goes through the night you losing track of time And you don't want to stop it because... Oh, What did you see last night, Pinky? To be honest with you, after Georgia finally chose Trent over Nate, I thought this morning's scene would be easy to narrate. The hotties hooked up, blah, blah, blah. But I'm stumped. I'll just point out Trent's four unopened condom packets and leave the rest to them. Hey. Hey. How are you? I'm OK. How are you? So good. It's good. Are you good? Yeah. I'm good. I just feel a bit rattled after last night, to be honest. Confused? Not confused, just like rattled. What are you thinking about? All sorts of stuff. <laughs> What's wrong? I need to get out. The brain's taking too much. I'm there. Like... I feel weird this morning, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god. What type of weird? I know, it feels weird not waking up next to Nate this morning. It's about waking up next to like every single day. Yeah. All along there was a fever. I was up at the literal crack of dawn and I was like, this does not feel nice. Like I feel so much dread. I don't feel it. I don't feel like this sexual attraction to you. And I've I I don't yeah, I just yeah.
than there is with Nate. Like when I'm with Nate, all I want to do is like kiss him and like cuddle him, but I just didn't feel that way with Trent. Oh my God, I've literally let the guy that I like go. Something felt like I was missing last night when we were sleeping here. Did you feel that? I don't know. Maybe it's just because, like, obviously it's so new. Makes me feel like I can't live without you. It takes me all the way. I want you to stay. I want you to stay. I feel like a fucking idiot. And I literally want to die. I heard you giggling. That wasn't the middle of the night. Can I talk oh, to you? Really? That was like just. Oh, straight away? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you just woke up. You can't talk to me. I feel like a fucking idiot. Huh? I feel like. <laughs> Don't tell me this. I went out there like, thinking like there was something that was just not. And I told him straight away in this morning. I was like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs>